Honesty, transparency, and a man with a servant's heart. That's the theme of the tributes pouring in for the Holy City's Chief of Police, Luther Reynolds. He shared a letter with the community saying that he is ending cancer treatments and entering hospice care. Our Molly McBride tells us how his colleagues describe his impact to the low country in his five years of leading the force. Chief Reynolds colleagues say he's a person who's committed his heart to public service and has the integrity needed to run a police department. You looked at this man and who was just a picture of health and then having to have to go through this. Um, and he just he took it with grace um, every step of the way. And I know that um, this this journey that he is going through, he's not going through it alone. We are with him on this. Council member Peter Shahid says Reynolds is always looking for ways to make the department better and more responsive to the community. He praises Reynolds for leading the department through the racial bias audit saying he embraced it every step of the way. Reynolds began his journey as chief of the Charleston Police Department in 2018. He shared his cancer diagnosis in November of 2021 and returned to his job three months later after losing a leg to cancer. Part of the letter Reynolds shared today reads, quote, I cannot tell you how proud I am of the men and women of the Charleston Police Department and how honored I am to have led them. As I set out on the final journey that God has planned for me, I'm thankful that I'll be able to spend these days in the city I've come to love, surrounded by family and friends. It is the last great gift in a life that's been full of them. Council member Shayed says the department is losing a person ahead of his time on policing, but he reassured me that Reynolds has built an amazing team and is leaving the department well equipped to keep the community safe. To read Reynolds full letter, you can find that under this web story at live5news.com. In the newsroom, Molly McBride, Live 5 News. Mayor John Tecklenburg has asked the three deputy chiefs to lead the department through this period. And we here at Live 5 would also like to take this time to thank Chief Reynolds for his service to the Charleston community.